so you found the perfect plugin for your Final Cut project but you don't know how to install it. Right now I'm going to show you the easiest way you can do just that. To get started, head over to your home folder, then inside that folder you should find a folder called Movies. Now inside your Movies folder there should be a folder called Motion Templates. If you can see this folder go ahead and skip this video to around 1 minute and 20 seconds. If you don't have it then we're going to need to create it now. So make a folder called Motion Templates, make sure you're spelling it with a capital M and a capital T. Once created, right click on the folder and select Get Info. In the Names and Extensions section, you need to add .localize to the end of the folder name. Make sure your folder is titled exactly as you can see here. Now, once you have your Motion Templates folder, we need to create four additional folders inside it. Effects, Generators, Titles and Transitions. Once you have these four folders created, you then have to do the same as we did for the Motion Templates folder and right click on each of them, go into Get Info and make sure they all have the .localized extension. Make sure you're adding these extensions through the Get Info window and not just in the Finder window, otherwise it will not work. Now from here you need to determine the type of plugin you're installing. If you're installing something from my digital store at visualsbyrimey.co.uk I mention which folder they need to be installed into in all of my products descriptions. Firstly make sure what you're trying to install is extracted if it was downloaded in a zip file. Then drag the folder containing your plugin into the relevant folder. For this example I'm going to be installing an effect so I'm going to use my effects folder. But if you're installing a title make sure it goes into your titles folder. If you're installing a transition make sure it goes into your transitions folder etc. Once it's been moved into the appropriate folder you should be able to find it inside Final Cut. For effects and transitions if you don't see it as its own separate category look under custom. In some cases you may need to close and relaunch Final Cut. Hopefully this helped you get on your way with using your new plugins. If so, be sure to check out the rest of the videos on my channel. I have a lot of extra plugins available for free download with a lot more resources on the way. I look forward to seeing you in my future videos.